Hello there, and welcome back. Well, guess what? It's been free days, and yes, that's free business days. Not counting a Saturday and Sunday. And my advent calendar still hasn't arrived. But, the good news is that uh, I contacted uh, Indigo. And I told them that I wasn't getting the uh, advent calendar in the mail. Yeah. I didn't uh, contact the post office. I contacted the uh, store that I bought the advent calendar from, Indigo. And yes, I ordered it online. So, uh, hopefully I'll... I'll hear back from them. Yeah, it would be, uh, it would be lucky if, uh, I got my advent calendar tomorrow. That's a big if, by the way. Alright, enough talk about the uh, status of the advent calendar. Remember notebooks? You know, these uh, tiny uh, laptops with uh, no CD drives. Well, if you don't, let me give you a, a brief story about them. You see, in, uh, in the 2000s, the uh, mid to late 2000s, I think, and uh, the early 2010s, Notebooks were uh, all the rage. They were uh, one of the uh, biggest things around. But, just like uh, VW Westlife, or V Westlife, or however you pronounce his name on YouTube, I didn't buy one when they were uh, still popular. So, what happens to notebooks, you must say? Well, when the uh, I think when the uh, iPad was introduced, the uh, popularity of notebooks started to dwindle. While you do see uh, a Chromebook every now and then, and there are... And heck, there are still some notebooks being sold in other countries. Notebooks were no longer, how we say, popular. Nowadays, it's uh, tablets that are the, uh, the big hot thing. You know, devices that are similar to iPads. Alright, so uh, this is... Uh, an HP uh, Mini 110 that I got for uh, 50 bucks. And uh, here it is in its uh, good old carrying case. Yep, we'll get back to that later. Here's some of the uh, guff it came up, it came with. the. Uh, the manuals and some of the uh, documentation, power cable, and get this, it came with uh, a Logitech mouse, I think one of the uh, things fell out, the things that you stick on the notebook. Yeah, I probably might use that for a uh, a gaming rig that I'll probably uh, buy cheaply. You know, like a uh, Windows 7 gaming rig or a Windows XP gaming rig. And let's go to the uh, device itself. Now, as I said before, Notebooks are uh, 
are these little tiny laptops that didn't come with a uh, CD-ROM drive. And this doesn't come with one because it's not big enough to fit to fit one in. Yeah. On the uh, on this side, you got the headphone jack and the uh, USB ports, and you got like a uh, a VGA connector and an Ethernet port in case if you uh, want to connect to uh, dial-up internet. But I bet that hardly anybody connects to a uh, dial-up internet these days. Yeah, so... Yeah, I know that uh, there are some people that hate notebooks because a um, lack of CD-ROM drive in the uh, Intel Atom processors. But, you do have to keep in mind that these computers weren't meant to be used as a main computer. They were uh, meant to be like a companion to your uh, larger computer. Or a, uh, a little device that you can, uh, you can, like, uh, go on the internet at any given time and put it in your, uh, backpack because, uh, laptops, uh, you had to, like, with, with, uh, many laptops you had to, like, get, like, a carrying bag for it if you want to carry around. But this, you can, like, put in your, uh, backpack and that's it if you want to use this as the uh, main computer you had to get like an external CD-ROM drive and expand the memory because well this computer doesn't have like uh, very much memory in it alright let's get this bad boy started Yep, and it has like a Windows 7 starter, and no, that's not the full version of Windows 7. Because it's obviously not uh, big enough to be put on like a, such a tiny device like this. It's the uh, starter edition. And before you ask, Yes, there are some notebooks out there that have Windows XP. I have one upstairs. It's a uh, a Dell laptop. It's a Dell notebook. And uh, like uh, V W Westlake or V Westlake or however you pronounce his name said, notebooks were the last computers on the market to come with. Uh, to come pre-installed with Windows XP because they weren't powerful enough to uh, run Windows Vista. Yeah. Boots up pretty fast. In fact, it uh, boots up, probably boots up faster than my uh, Dell Inspiron, not Inspiron, Dell Latitude laptop. That's my that was my former school laptop. All right, so I'll uh, enter the password off off screen and uh, we can get ready. <laughs> I want you. Oh, and I want you to look at my uh, Ashley painting that I got displayed on the wall while I enter in the uh, password. All right. Hope you had enough uh, looking at the painting because I entered in the password. And here we are. All right. So uh, I'm only gonna like uh, test like. A few programs on there since this thing doesn't have a CD-ROM drive and I can't like uh, play my uh, PC games on it. So let's play some Zuma Deluxe. I'm sure you uh, 
You all know what this game looks like. Yeah, this might take... Oh! Here we are. HP Games, powered by uh, Wild Tangent, or Tangent, or however you want to pronounce it. It's loading. Oh, it's doing a uh, game console update. Get that on my face. Yeah, don't you just hate it when uh, when things have to update? Yeah, no, that I have to update like my uh, programs on my iPad every week or every two weeks. All right, let's go ahead and play. Zuma Deluxe. Oh, and uh, by the way, this uh, came pre installed with Zuma Deluxe. Let's do the uh, adventure. New game, please. Yeah, I'm on uh, level two. All right, let's shoot the balls. Yeah, no, this uh, game looks sort of like uh, Magnetica, but I'm sure like uh, a lot of you probably uh, know that by, by now. All right, let's get the red ball in. Yeah, we're shooting balls. Alright, that'll be a, uh, enough of that. Let's go back to the main menu. Ah, plays pretty well, I have to say. Get that out of my face. Oh, and, uh, by the way. I uh, downloaded a uh, internet browser on this uh, computer. It's called uh, Pale Moon. And yes, I know it's the uh, same exact internet browser that uh, V Westlife or VW Westlife or however you want to pronounce his name used when he di when he uh, did his uh, video on the uh, Toshiba notebook. All right, let's test it out. And it's uh, the 32-bit version, by the way. Because it's the uh, only version that will work on this computer. All right, let's uh, search something. Alright, so what should we uh, search? How about... Uh, hmm, what should we search? Oh, I know. We should search... Uh, how about we... Uh, get that out of my face. How about uh, we uh, search, uh, let's go take a look at, uh, hmm. 
I know. The, uh... Spitfire, because... Why the heck not? Oh, and I, uh, misspelled it, by the way. It was a, uh, it's a spelling error. There we go. Yeah, there's, uh, pictures of the, uh, good old plane of the, uh, Royal Air Force. And, yes, they, uh, the Royal Canadian Air Force did use these planes. Sorry if my hand's in the way. Alright, let's uh, watch a uh, video on YouTube to see if... Uh, this browser will play YouTube videos. Alright, so, uh, let's, uh, watch one of my own videos, the, uh, Otaku Bandito, since I own the copyrights. Alright, what should we, uh, watch? Oh, and uh, by the way, this sort of uh, works better than uh, the uh, iBook G3 because it's well, it's a newer machine, and it's uh, it's well, while it's old, it's still like released in 2009, where the iBook G3 Snow has been released like in 2001, and it's still useful. Hmm. Let's go to the second page. How about uh, we watch the uh, iPad mini review? Yep, that's my, uh, well, that's not the, uh, iPad that I have right now that was the, that was the one that I used to own. I currently have like a, a newer model iPad. It's uh, bigger and it's got like a faster processor and stuff. Yeah, yeah, allow. Man, the uh Otaku Bandito Reviews has gone so far, haven't they? Yeah, it's nice to uh, look back on my old videos. Yep. This is going to be a quick review because I'm not going to go too much in depth about this tablet, so... Let's, let's just uh, cut to the part where uh, I use it. And we'll save ourselves some time. Yep, this was my first ever iPad that I got. And the first thing we... Oops. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. And the first thing... Yep, well, that'd be enough of that. Alright, so, yeah. Yep, it's, uh, it's amazing how, uh, how tablets are everywhere nowadays. 
But I still remember notebooks being a thing. Let's shut this uh, sucker down. And it also takes a while to shut down. Alright, well, because uh, it's most Windows 7 computers take forever to shut down. Alright, so that concludes my uh, retrospective slash review on the uh, HP 110. And I'll see you later, alligator.